Hello, hello everyone. It is your girl Amanda here from my channel Amanda Random and I have a end of the week Dollar Tree haul for you guys. So wait till you check out some of this new stuff I found. Stay tuned and you'll see. All right, everybody, I had to show you these first. They were just putting these out. This is one pair. Um, they are for the size five to six and a half, and they're the Frozen socks. Oh my God, they're so cute. Look at her. Um, I'm hoping these will fit Jazz, but the more I look at them, they look a little small. So if they don't, they will definitely fit her cousin Ireland. So those were all new. They had Frozen, they had my Little Pony, they had Sheriff Callie, they had so much. Um, I also picked this Sprite up. These are these are scores for 1.25 liters for a dollar. Um, my husband also wanted to try this Rip It Energy Fuel Power, and it's an energy drink. Um, and he wanted to try the red one, so I finally remembered to pick some up. And I did pick up two of those for him. And then one of the new products that I finally found were these cute, cute storage jars. There are these tiny little mason jars with the covers. Like, how cute is this? We can come up with either an awesome DIY or just use them as they are, as adorable as they are, and put, you know, all kinds of different things in there. Um, those would be cute to keep sequins in and stuff that you want to leave sit out, like up on your desk or something, to make it look really cool. So... Um, I definitely picked two packs of those up. Um, the hubby is a smoker, and I found these Crocs Handy Lighter. Um, I also like the long reach nozzles for lighting candles and things like that, so I did pick up a black one and an orange one. Um, now, these were new. These are the Ballparks brand. This is the Flame Grilled Barbecue, and this is pork jerky. So... These are brand new. They were just putting them out. Um, so I picked up the Flame Grilled Barbecue of the Pork Jerky and the Ballpark Flame Grilled Teriyaki Pork Jerky. So I thought, you know what? We love pork steaks. So jerky, pork, teriyaki, barbecue. Uh-huh. This Wisconsin girl is about about it. That's right. Um, the item of the day that they try to give away <laughs> when you get up to the to the cashier and you know you get done checking out and they're like do you need a light up led necklace and usually i'm always like yeah sure so when it was actually something cool i was glad we got this um hopefully i'll be running around wearing this light up led necklace for our fourth of july party so that was definitely cool um these new little dr fresh travel kits are awesome. They come with their own little, you can tell that it zips, and it comes with the little cover for your toothbrush, a toothbrush, and a little travel-sized Colgate. So I thought, how freaking awesome, you know, You even when you're done, you can keep the bag, you know? Like, yeah, I don't know. So I got one for me and a one for my husband, and the kids already have little um, travel packs, so when we go camping this summer, um, we stay at a yurt on a beach, and it's just, like, amazing. Um, my son, believe it or not, my 11-year-old son swears by these when he gets a migraine or a headache. And I think we either lost our last one or just didn't get put back in the freezer. I don't know. Um, but this is an eye mask, so he can feel all... I don't know. He seriously loves these. You put them in the freezer or even in the um, fridge, let it get really cold, and he just lays it across his head, and man, he's chillaxing. So, the other thing I found were some new books. This one looked really good, and it's Zom B Gladiator. So, I don't know. You can take a look at the back if you want. They were just putting this one out, and it just looked really cool, and I love reading, especially in the summer, um, so I love reading all kinds of books, so these are, like, great books to take when you do go camping, because this is, let's face it, for me, this is, like, a quick little, um, simple, easy read, and in this book, there are some, like, illustration pages, which I thought was really cool. Um, then I found this book by Tess Gerritsen, and it is Die 
again. And I just, I don't know, something about the girl on the front kind of drew me in with the eyes and the face. And um, it just, it says that it's a hit series on TNT. So I was like, hmm, I'm checking this out. I love my Dollar Tree books. You never know what you're going to find. And when you pick one up and read it, you're like, oh, amazing. That was amazing. What a good book. And then you're all ecstatic that you picked it up. Um, I did find this cute little composition notebook, and I just really liked the cover. Um, and I still haven't decided if I want to use the comp composition notebook again for my Fobonichi journal. Um, now that my new one, or my third one, is coming to an end. So I'm still not sure, but I picked this up just because I love having these. These are great to put extra paint in when you're done instead of, you know, if you're painting something, instead of wasting what's left over, just take a briar and scrub it in your book and make pretty backgrounds, and you can turn that into Lord knows what, because art is art, even if it's crazy. And now these are a repurchase for me. I did show you guys that I bought these previously, and this is by the Jot brand, and it's the organizer, organizer file. And through these little tabs here, these holes, you get these little tabs to fill in the sides so that you can see straight through here whatever it is you choose to file and keep. And like I have been saying, I've been doing a lot of clippings from um, magazines and such for my art books and things like that. And I thought, how cool if I was like, okay, here's faces, here's bodies, here's... God, that makes me sound like, like a freaking serial killer. Um, like, you know, here's animals or here's birds, here's butterflies, here's wings, here's... I like taking all kinds of different things out of them and using them and kind of collaging them all down together and making new crazy ideas. Um, I also will be having a DIY to show you guys that whole process. Um, and then my last item, I'm actually... That's not my last item. This is... No polish remover. How freaking amazing. Yeah. Woo. Yay. Okay, whatever. Yeah, it's nail polish remover. And this is butt wipe because you never want to leave home without it. Um, actually, I always leave home without it, but Angel Soft for a dollar. You get four rolls. Keep it in my closet because we like to, you know, keep our butts friendly and friendly. I don't know if we like to keep our butts friendly, but we like to keep our butts clean. So, we often run out of toilet paper, and it is great to have one of those on hand to just be like, have no fear, Angel Soft is here. Alrighty. Now, I have showed you guys this book previously, and this is a big, big book. Um, this is When Everything Changed, The Amazing Journey of American Women from 1960 to the Present. And then if you look in the bottom, it says it's also a keepsake journal to preserve and share personal memories of the way things were for you. I previously showed this book, and there was a lady who told me that she was on the search for this book. And what's cool about it is you can read, you know, like when women's rights were and whatnot, and then you can add in your thoughts and memories of the time or, you know, where were you the first time? You know, there's just so many cool things in here um, about liberating women and just all of the awesome stuff. And the fact that you can journal in it to me is just like bada bing, bada boom. It makes it even cooler. Um, there's... Like this here, were you a Buffy the Vampire Slayer fan? If not, try to remember the first time you saw another action heroine and how you reacted. So this is something really cool for a keepsake for you to fill out. Um, keep it for your kids. Keep it for keep it for yourself to look back on. But anyway, blah, blah, blah about the book. There was a lady who showed me, and I'm going to try to find the video, and I'm going to try to find your name. And you said that you had lived through a bunch of this stuff and that you would love to find this book. And I hope that you're still out there and I hope you're still watching because if you are, please contact me because I did purchase this book for you. Um, I would love to try to get it to you and send it out to you. So if you could get a hold of me, um, email me or even write me uh, underneath this video. Um, I will have my email and all the ways to contact me in the description underneath this video. So that was my Dollar Tree haul for the end of this week. And I just wanted to say thank you to everybody. Much love to all my randoms. 
and I will be back and see you soon. Have a safe weekend, everybody.